So great question. Um, I think that question I'll flip to software and we haven't really talked at all about what I do in software. Um, but it's really hard to outsource when you're building, when you're making donuts, right? You have to like, it's part of your company, it's part of your DNA. You, you, there's like too many standards it, it, and, and the cost, especially in DC where minimum wage is $15 an hour. I know it's great for people that work at the, uh, at the local Chick-fil-A, uh, but you know, for restaurants, it's a very difficult scenario. Um, so um, yeah, when it comes to outsourcing, uh, it, it's, you, you, you do have to like look at pieces that are perfect for outsourcing. And, and on, the, on the tech side, we've outsourced our marketing, so our PR, we've completely outsourced. We have one person that like leads the initiative, uh, but you know, we've done that. You can outsource a lot of lower level development in software, so you need to have like the architects and the, 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 the strategists and people that really know how to code and engineer, but you can outsource a lot of like the menial kind of task related work. Um, so, so yeah, I think the problem is outsourcing costs more money. Well it, well, it depends. There are some areas where you can save a lot of money, like if you outsource to like a different country, but if you bring on consultants, advisors here in the States, it, it, it's more expensive and you just don't have that luxury when you're starting off. So again, going back to one of the four good tenants, you have to work with people that you, like complementarity is, is so important. Like I'm really good at the marketing, business development, fundraising side. Greg is a cost, I was gonna say, well, okay, fine. It's a cost Nazi, you know, like he really, he like really gets to the bottom of every single like dynamic, the build out. He like, and that's, I hate that. I don't like doing that, like, but you need to do it. And you need someone that can make donuts. You don't want me making those donuts. If you ate donuts that I made, you'd, you wouldn't be here right now, you'd leave, right? So, so that's, I think that, that piece, around partnership and who you bring to the table, that your partners are what are gonna help you kind of get off the ground because you just can't afford to do it with anybody else.